Stay rooted and grounded. That's right. Sometimes it's not easy to stay in a place, you know, where you feel like you're not wanted, to stay in a place where you feel like you're not appreciated, to stay a place in a place where you're definitely not celebrated. You know, people say, well, if you're not celebrated and just tolerated in a certain place, then you should not stay, you should go, you should leave. But the thing about that is, Jesus was not celebrated either. Hey, maybe when he first started out and he turned the water into wine and they had never seen such a feat. He probably was at least, you know, they took notice of him. And uh, they saw the miracles that he performed. And he healed the sick. He made the lame to walk. He restored the sight to the blind. He did wonderful miracles in the sight of people. The people celebrated him and they said, Hosanna, Hosanna, Hosanna in the highest. But those same people soon turned on him. And they said, crucify him, crucify him. They even took it to a place of insult, to injury. And we're not talking about just any little injury. Physically, mentally, emotionally. He sweat when he prayed and he said, If it be thy will, let this cup pass from me. He sweat drops of blood. So this was not something small that Jesus went through. He went through. But he had an assignment that he had to fulfill. He had an assignment. And as uncomfortable as the situation was, as unbearable as the situation was, he had an assignment that he had to fulfill. He has given us all an assignment. Should Jesus bear the cross alone? We have to take up our cross daily and follow him. Stay rooted, stay planted where you are until you definitely hear God speak to you and tell you it's time to go. Don't go to and fro. This is the hour where men, they will fall away from the face. You stay rooted and grounded and be the difference in wherever you are today. Take it from me. I know. Been there.